The Sarasota Public Art Collection has been widely criticized. Many people do not think this is art. They think it's an eyesore. Regardless, it's a popular attraction in Sarasota. The statue, called Unconditional Surrender, is 25 feet tall and it was created by the artist Seward Johnson. It celebrates the end of World War II that occurred on August 14, 1945 in Times Square. A picture appeared in Life magazine of a sailor grabbing a nurse. Some people feel this is offensive because the woman didn't ask to be grabbed. But in the statute, it looks like she's enjoying it. On any given day in Sarasota, you will see dozens of tourists humiliating themselves and unconditional surrender. Here are just a few examples. And speaking of ridiculous displays of public affection, oh my god, take this to a motel room. Okay, he's holding her tight. Left arm around the neck. You're not playing Twister. Oh. And we came all the way from the Dominican Republic to get our picture taken here at Unconditional Surrender. Here's another one. Tourists come from all over the world to take in this statue here in Sarasota. And here are some German tourists taking pictures of unconditional surrender. I wonder if they know how ironic this is. What do you think? Is this art or is it trash? <laughs>